peace love smiles and truth everybody um just wondering if anyone out there ever had any experience um or any uh supernatural events happen to them or someone that they know in their life um i got a friend named james and uh james had some interesting stuff happen to him uh while he was living in north dakota he's no longer there now but um at the time he was he was staying with his girlfriend and her mother in a trailer home in a trailer park and um he said every night well not every night but most nights when he would get up in the middle of the night to go get a drink of water or something like that uh he would go into the kitchen and above the refrigerator um there was always like some papers that would fly off and hit him in the head and when he was telling me the story i was laughing i was like what that don't sound right like something just hit you in the head he was like yeah it'd be pitch black dark you know i just turn on like a little a, a light like in the living room or whatever and these papers or whatever was on top of the fridge would just fly off and hit me in the head every time and i'll be like what, what, what was that and i was like was your was the window open in the kitchen by the sink or something like was something maybe blowing the wind he was like every time though like it would always happen i was like well did your girlfriend her mom have pets and he was like the dog was always in the kennel and the cat you know would be in the other room or sometimes it'd be like it'll follow me if it's not asleep uh it'd be by my leg or whatever and he's like one time it happened or whatever the the cat like ran out of the room you know when it happened or whatever but uh i was like did you investigate he was like yeah i'll, I'll look and on top of the fridge it'll be nothing and so he said that would happen and it would happen mostly around like three o'clock in the morning i was like three o'clock in the morning like three on the dot he's like sometimes it'd be like a little after three or whatever i was like three o'clock they say that's the witching hour um but yeah, so that's that's uh, some stories, uh, you know, about that happening to him. He ended up moving out of there, and, uh, and some other stories happened at another place. I'll say that in the in the next video.